What's good? Mark Turner, Turned Up Fitness. Hey, check this out. I had a little health tip I wanna pass to y'all. Now, what I'm doing, I'm actually working on my certification for nutrition, but I'm still trying to study right now. I'm gonna take the test very soon, probably the beginning of the year. I'm gonna take the test, go ahead and knock the thing out to get my third certification. So if you don't know me by now, I'm a certified personal trainer, NASM certified. Um, also, NASM Creative Exercise certified. Now I'm working on my nutrition, so if you know what to get with me, you know, you just follow me on the channel. I pass it out. Make sure you pass the word out on Turned Up Fitness Smart. Turn to get it in for 2016, 2017. That's how we do it. But I wanted to give you this nutrition fact on popcorn. You know, I'm trying to find a way to snack a little bit better because, you know, I try not to drink. I'm trying to stop smoking. That's one of my biggest things, stop smoking as a personal trainer. And I'm going to tell you like this. I'm doing it because I know it's important, and I'm being truthful to y'all that y'all know. That's one of my bad vices, but I'm about to get over that, and that's why I'm doing this about this popcorn, because it seems like popcorn keeps me from doing that. And popcorn actually is a healthy snack. You know, probably get about 130 calories. Well, actually, if you air pop your popcorn without any oil touching it, you get about 30, about 30 calories um, from um, four cups. About, I'm gonna say roughly uh, four grams that you're getting. But the hit the crazy thing about it is, you know, it got nutrition, it got fiber. It helps with a lot of uh, things that women like with the anti-aging and all that crazy stuff. I am not a doctor. I'm just giving you facts that I have read and understand because I'm taking this test. But one of the good things about this is, is that you need to make sure you understand that. Find a way to um, curb your appetite. Find a way to get away from bad habits. And popcorn, kettle, that kettle popcorn is good. Microwave popcorn is good. But um, it's better to do it yourself. If you want to know how to do kettle popcorn, you know, you can go online and find a ways out to make some kettle popcorn. But make sure you air pop everything that you're making because it really doesn't matter until you start getting to excesses of sugar and, you know, and salt and stuff like that. So try to keep it more natural. Butter is not a good thing because it got the, the, the saturated fats in that. And there's a long chain means it takes a long time to digest. Um, it's one of those items that you got to make sure if you're going to use certain types of oil, go with some um, olive oil or some um, vegetable oil, canola oil, or something like that. But you don't want to use a lot. But um, that's pretty much what I wanted to say to y'all. I hope that you understand what I'm saying about this nutrition when it comes to uh, popcorn and um, beating your vices. But this is your boy Mark Turner, Turned Up Fitness, 2016, 2017, about to turn it up for the next year. Get with me if y'all need to get with me. Website be coming out next year. I'm um, working on some other things, but make sure y'all keep following me. About to get y'all back in the gym. We're going to do it right once I get this new camera. All right, talk to y'all soon.